Hello guys. Meet again with Movie Adult Recapped. In this video, we will discuss about a film called Thing is a Virus. And although the title of this film has the word virus, but in this film there is no virus or disease at all. This film is about a married man. And because they have a very large house, they finally intend to rent out the second floor of their house. Because on the second floor his house was never occupied. It turned out that the one who rented the second floor was a friend of his wife who was very beautiful and sexy. So before you continue this video, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you. The film begins with a woman knocking on the door of a house. But the owner of the house still hasn't woken up. Maybe because he slept late. Naturally, if it's noon he still hasn't woken up. But because the sound of knocking on the door did not stop. The owner of the house finally woke up from sleep. It turned out that the man's name was Sungri and the woman's name was Songhee. Because Sungri still feels sleepy. So he didn't notice that she was only wearing underwear. Finally, he rushed to put on his clothes. By the way, the man was married. But it's been two months since his wife returned to her hometown to visit her parents. Maybe, because Sungri feels lonely living alone at home. Sungri took the initiative to rent out a room on the second floor. It turns out that his wife's friend, she named Songhee, intends to rent the room. Sungri doesn't know if he is his wife's friend or not. Because Sungri has never met Songhee before. Sungri then tried to immediately call his wife to confirm whether Songhee was his friend or not. But suddenly Songhee took the cell phone from Sungri. And it turns out that Songhee is really a friend of his wife. Finally, Sungri accompanied Songhee to the second floor and showed her a rented room. After seeing the room, Songhee seemed quite comfortable staying in the room. Then Sungri left Songhee alone. A few hours later, Songhee seemed to be going somewhere. And as a good host, Sungri asked Songhee, Where are you going? Then Songhee answered, I'm going to meet my new boyfriend. Then Songri also cares a little for Songhee and says be careful on the road. Because this Songhee is wearing a very sexy dress. Songri is also worried that Sang will be harassed by men out there. Then Songhee went to meet her boyfriend who was in an empty house. And the man's name is Insook. They also look like a couple in love like lovers in general. Then Songhee invited Insook to go to his new residence which was at Sungri's house. Maybe because they were already feeling horny. They ended up having sex in Songhee's room. Meanwhile, Sungri was relaxing and smoking alone. Apparently, Sungri was tempted by Songhee's body and breasts that were so sexy. And he took the initiative to look for opportunities to have sex with Songhee. At night, Songhee drove her boyfriend out of the house because he would come home after having sex from day to night. And suddenly Sungri came and approached him. And then, they together entered the house. When in the house, they then sit down and discuss a topic, but suddenly Sang got a call, and it turned out to be from his boyfriend. And she then immediately went to his room. But a few minutes later, Sungri heard the sound of crying. And it turned out that the voice came from Songhee. Sungri then asked Songhee, Why are you crying? Then Songhee answered, If his boyfriend named In Suk asks to separate from him. Even though he just had sex with Songhee, it turns out that In Suk is a playboy. He also often seduces women just to have sex. After getting what he wanted, he then decided to leave her. After hearing the story from Songhee, Sungri then became sympathetic to Songhee. Then Sungri invited Songhee to drink alcohol together. And hope Songhee can forget in Suk and not be sad anymore. Meanwhile, Sungri continued to accompany Songhee and listen to his sad story. A few hours later, Sang his unconscious. Because she drank too much alcohol. Then Sungri took him to the room. Because Sungri has long been tempted by Songhee's sexy body. Finally, he ventured to have sex with Songhee. The next morning, well after they have sex, 
It seems Sungri is comfortable with Songhee's presence at his house. Even when his wife called to ask how Sungri was, Sungri instead said not to worry too much about him. Sungri even told his wife, "It doesn't matter if you come home in 10 months." Maybe because Sungri has felt pleasure and is addicted to having sex with Songhee. And this movie is finished. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. See you in the next video.